All right, guys, we are back at it again. As most of you know, I did cancel my BoxyCharm subscription. We had just been going through some things, and I just made the decision that it was best that we part our ways before it got ugly, you know? Anyways, so in place of BoxyCharm, I did order Ipsy. Now, I want the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, but apparently you have to be a subscriber to the regular one and like on this wait list so I'm on the wait list but this is my first bag and this is April 2019 so let's rip on in here and see if there's anything good I was supposed to get and I did perfect um for signing back up because I had been signed up to Ipsy like a couple years ago um, I got a gift to come back and I got this Huda lip strobe and this is in the color saucy. Let's just put it on. I don't typically, whoo! She is saucy. So, alrighty then. Mmm. That she definitely is. I love the smell of the formula of her lipstick. So that's great. That's not in everyone's Ipsy, but just know that if you cancel and they want you to come back, they do always offer a free gift. So we only got for a good one. This is what our April Ipsy bag looks like. It's little lemons and it feels kind of vinyl. So let's just get right into this business, okay? I'm just going to pull everything out. Ooh, the inside of the bag is my favorite color. Super cute. Ooh, this might be good for traveling or something like that, so it's good. So here's our little card. And then it says, build your dream bag. Get any clam bag product you want. Ooh, so they let you, like, buy things separately. I don't know if y'all have seen that or not. That's new from the last time I was with them. So let's just jump on in. The first thing we have is this fan brush here. It's got gray bristles, which is weird. It feels very soft. It's absolutely synthetic. And this is by Billion Dollar Brushes. And this, I have no idea how much this stuff retails for. So yeah, they just don't tell you. I don't know. I don't know, but they're suggesting use it for highlighter. So maybe. <laughs> My favorite highlighting brush is a Luxie brush, actually. It's this Luxie tapered highlighter, so I'm going to stick with this for a while. But if I ever want to mix it up, do something different, I might pull that out. The next thing we have is the Moods by Laura Sanchez. Super cute. This is an individual eyeshadow, and it is in a shimmery green. I think my lights are kind of off here. Let me pull it back there. It's in a shimmery green. Let's swatchy that. It feels, was it drier than I expected? Um, there's after, like, working my finger in it for a minute. But it does swatch very nicely. Ooh, and this little thing is magnetic, which is cool. Um, yeah, so it's pretty cool. I don't have any idea how much that is supposed to, um, go for, um, but it's green with a gold shimmer, olive green with a gold shimmer, and you can, you can definitely see that, so that's pretty cool. Moving on, we have this The Balm Jour Creamy Lip Stain. I think it's in shade Salou. Like, if you're Russian and you're taking shots of vodka. And this is about the same color. I have. Not the Huda that I have on my lips, but that is right up my alley. It's like a mauve color, which is super cool. And it doesn't smell like anything, so that's great. It's a small, might fit in your purse or your pocket. Pretty cool. Um, I'm not going to put that back in there. Next thing we have is called Answer from Luminous Collagen Eye Cream. And this is just a little sample. So that's pretty cool. We do have a safety seal. I currently have an eye cream open, so I'm not going to open this to smell it. But super cool. I'm always happy to get those because 
Eye creams last so long. I think I'm still going on a sample that I've had for quite a while. I don't know. I can't reach it right now. But the small tubes, they last so long because you use so little of them. So I don't mind samples of that. And the last thing in our Ipsy today is the a sample of the Tarte Base Tape Hydrating Primer. Which is super cool because I do want to try this. I love primers. So, oh, it's a little bit more runny than I thought it was going to be. Kind of just poured out all over my hand here. Um, I'm just going to spread it out. It smells, it smells like coconut. It smells like coconut water. It smells really good. Um, so it just spreads out into nothingness. It's a little bit shiny on my hand. I wonder if it's going to dry down or not. I don't know. Um, yeah, it looks like it's dried down, but and it's it doesn't feel tacky at all. So we're good there. I'm going to try this out because I've been thinking about buying it. So I'm happy I got that. So this was this month's Ipsy, normal Ipsy, the small one. Um, this is $10 every month on a recurring subscription, and you get, like, samples or deluxe size samples. Sometimes full fancy products. So that's good. And brushes. I love that we get brushes. So... That was kind of the draw back to Ipsy while I was waiting on the Ipsy Glam Plus. So, super exciting. Anyways, did you get this month? Did you get the same things as I did? Let me know in the comment section below. Also, let me know any other bags that you think are worth trying out. Because, I mean, I do have a hole in my life now that I don't have boxy charms. So, I am on the prowl for a new makeup friend. So leave it in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys next time. Bye.